everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video I wanted to take you along and show you what I do to have a relaxing night routine so I always love to start off my night I haven't done it in a really really long time but I love to light a candle and get out all of my nice like bath bombs and bath salts and have a really nice relaxing bath I highly recommend it and I love to just put on worship music or sometimes watch a TV show, uh, whatever I kind of feel like doing, but just allowing my body to relax and my mind just to switch off and really just relax after a long week. So these are some of my favorite products. I love using bath salts because it relaxes my body. Um, and then this bath bomb was really cool. I hadn't used one in a really, really long time. But this was really cool and it made the water all nice and it smelt amazing. This is the skincare that I've been using recently. It's called Real You. And I've been really having trouble with my skin, just like breaking out and pimples and stuff. And this just makes my skin feel really healthy and hydrated. So I've been loving to use this. The next thing, oh, get rid of those work clothes. It is time to change into some comfy clothes so that I can just continue relaxing. The next thing I always do is feed my dog. That's a nightly routine in our household. Isn't she so cute? Oh, she loves and gets so excited when it's food time. And then it's food time for me and my family. So we love to eat food together and eat dinner together and sometimes have dessert. I'm heavy banana caramel ice cream. So and after that, especially on the weekends, we love to just sit down and watch a TV show or watch a movie. Um, depends what we're in the mood for. We love a good action film and we also love a good... Oh, a good movie that gets your heart heart aching and heart sad but it's always heaps of fun and lucy always joins us she loves to have a snuggle on the couch and she often falls asleep even during the action movies when there's stuff going on she still falls asleep but she is super super precious if you have a dog or an animal in general please let me know what you have down below now getting into the rest of my night, I love to have a time where I'm creative. So this can look like many different things. It could just be journaling and journaling out my day if I have any worries or things I need to cast over to God or if it's been a really good day and I want to remember that, I love to journal at night as well as in the morning. Another creative thing that I've been loving doing recently is scrapbooking. I have so many photos from my time at YWAM and I really wanted to just jot down all of the memories that I had from there because I never want to forget it. So I started out with these pages here. Um, these are all of the people that were in my DTS, the Performing Arts DTS. So I've left a few blank pages. So I'm going to put in photos and notes that they'd written me so that I never forget the special memories with them. And then I printed out a whole bunch of photos with a bunch of my other friends from other DTSs and just fun things that we did. Um, as I said, I called it YWAM at a glance, but I've started, this was the first spread that I did and putting some of the first photos that I took at YWAM in there. And then I was just getting started on another page. This is my beautiful friend Naomi and she's from Ireland, which is so cool. And it was her birthday recently. There's photos from Australia Day. There's photos from morning workout. Um, this was from our Mexican fundraiser that we did. Um, just so many beautiful memories. So I'm just starting to go through all the photos in order and just jot down all of the memories that I want to remember. Another creative thing that I've been loving doing recently, I've recently swapped out, I, I used to have a laptop and I decided to sell that and buy an iPad Pro because I really want to get into um, digital like illustration. So these are a couple things that I've been getting up to. Um, I've been loving just kind of experimenting with that and drawing like everything, drawing plants and trackers and stuff like that. So I'm just going to pop on a little time lapse of me finishing uh this new one that i've been doing so enjoy
thing I love doing is reading my Bible. Now, I do my quiet time in the morning, but sometimes I like to do it at night or do an extra part of time at night if there's a specific scripture that God speaks to me about um, that he wants me to read or if there's just a particular one that I feel like I want to. Um, I love to just relax and read and see what... Um, God just wanted to sum up about my day or just remind me of um, for the next day. One of my favorite things recently has been watching sermons and my favorite one has been from Transformation Church with Pastor Michael Todd. He has this new um, series that I've spoken about in other videos and it is incredible. So sometimes I'll watch a sermon um, so I kind of just pick between all of these different things and I love watching sermons at night. It's a super great way just to relax and get fed up in my spirit. And before bed, I've really been trying to build this spiritual habit, but before I go to bed, I really love reading. And this is the book that I'm reading at the moment. It's by Sadie Robertson and it's called Live Fearless. She is a super big role model in my life and I've been really enjoying it so far. As you can see, I've only just started. But yeah, I love reading and then just switching off the technology and reading just to wind down before I go to sleep. <laughs> 